Maggie gets into the tub with her granddaughters, followed by Roosevelt and Ferris. It's coming directly towards us. And as he's saying that, the house started tearing off. The tornado hits their home dead on. Madison wraps her arms around her grandfather's neck. And I'm just calling Jesus' name, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Ferris is immediately swept into the vortex and disappears. Roosevelt grips Madison tighter. And I could feel it like the wind just tugging at my grandbaby. And I said, baby, please hold on to me. Don't let Papa go. I said, hold on to me. But he's no match for the 190 mile per hour winds. And they are hauled into the darkness. Maggie and her one-year-old granddaughter are the only ones left. Then the unthinkable happens. My grandbaby got sucked out of my arms. I looked up and I saw her go up into the storm. 